Welcome to Sparkflow's short video series. In this series, we will record a number of short videos on various topics related to the Sparkflow's product and the ecosystem. So, what is Sparkflow's? Sparkflow's is an Apache Spark native big data application development platform to help you accelerate and streamline the development of your big data products. In this very first video, we are going to look at where Sparkflows sits in the overall big data ecosystem. As you can see, on the left, I have various streaming and batch data sources. Right in the middle, on top, we have the Sparkflows, and underneath, we have the processing and execution platform. And on the right, we have various ways in which you can visualize the data coming out of the processing. So right on top in the middle where Sparkflow sit, you can see that the product provides a number of capabilities with respect to data prep, data analysis. The core of the platform is to help you build the end-to-end -end data pipeline, also called as a workflow, and help you execute that workflow on an Apache Spark native cluster. We also have a number of machine learning nodes that you can that you can leverage to build machine learning models and start serving. You can also write custom code within the workflow using Scala, SQL, or Jython nodes that we have provided. Underneath, you can see where the platform uh, where the platform runs. By default, it runs on an Apache Spark cluster. It could be a cluster from Cloudera, Hortonworks, or any of the other providers. It could run on-prem, or it could run on the cloud as well. On the right, you see how you visualize the results coming from your workflow execution. You could be uh, you could visualize them within the Sparkflow's UI, or you could plug in the results to any of the existing BI tools like Tableau, ClickView, or Microsoft BI. Or you could even have a custom web app, so like a simple HTML5 or an AngularJS based application, which could be exposing the results. Or let's say if it is recommendations or, or churn, it could be exposing those results in those custom applications. So with that, we'll see you in the next video. Thank you.